I've spent the last 10 years dancing in shows in the West End. I was in Cats for two years, um, Tonight's the Night, Singing in the Rain, and most recently I did Billy Elliot the Musical as in the original cast. Um, I was in that for four years. Um, so since then I've kind of stopped performing. I, I'm an associate lecturer now at the University of Chichester. I choreograph their shows there. Um, I'm in the process of choreographing on the town actually at the minute with the second year students. So then the musical supervisor for Cinderella is somebody that I work with on Billy Elliot and that's how I've come about to, to, do, to do this. It's, it's difficult because as a dancer you're kind of given the steps whereas a choreographer you've got to go away and be creative and be inventive and make the stuff kind of original and new. Um, but so far I'm quite enjoying it. So. There will be a beautiful ballroom scene, the style of the show will be very musical theatre, kind of Broadway jazz kind of feel to it, maybe some tap as well on the show, which will be good. So we, we just cast the older dancers last weekend in London and we, I found eight fantastic dancers. So. Yeah, no, I do. I think, if, if anything, it kind of promotes kind of healthy living and stuff, especially mm. for kids nowadays, to get them away from the TV and away from their video games and get them to exercise. Brilliant. So whether or not their skills are not, it's, you know, it's giving them some, some healthy living, I suppose. Um, Gene Kelly, Bob Fosse, I grew up with all the old films, so that's kind of my era. So that's a sort of hint yeah, as to what yeah, we might absolutely. expect in Cinderella. Yeah, yeah.